So I've just completed my AM4 benchmark rig for you guys and I'm happy to say I'll get you guys some day one coverage on March 2nd, so stay tuned for that. However, there was one little thing that I ran into that I just wanted to give you guys like an FYI or for your information, so let's take a look. Welcome back to Tech Yes City. This is Brian coming to you guys today with a quick video on just the AM4 cooler compatibility and what's going to happen, guys. So if you've gone out and pre-ordered your Ryzen CPU, you're going to get your motherboard. Just be aware that on day one, a lot of the bolt-down coolers with AM3 compatibility actually won't fit AM4 motherboards. Now, I've talked about this with Steve from Harbor Unboxed. He's sent me a photo in and he has confirmed that the AM3 Wraith cooler will fit the AM4 socket. So it looks like a lot of those latch down coolers will fit the AM4 socket. However, I know that bolt down coolers will unfortunately not fit the AM4 platform unless the motherboard manufacturers have the AM3 holes drilled out as well as the AM4 holes. So the AM3 holes are a little bit longer in length. They're kind of a similar structure, but I've found that I had to zip tie my cooler down and I've tested out quite a few coolers around here too, by the way. I even managed to get this Cooler Master 212 to almost fit. It's just that I would have had to pretty much ruin the bracket to get it fit in even only one diagonal direction. So just a little FYI for you guys, if you are buying a cooler on day one, make sure that it fits AM4. If not, and you can wait a little bit, then I'm sure a lot of the cooler manufacturers will be bringing out brackets and they will be sending them out hopefully for free to you guys if you already have an expensive cooler. I generally find that the bigger air coolers and also the all-in-ones tend to bolt down. So these are the ones that will generally have the compatibility issues because you have to bolt them down from the top and you will need those AM4 holes lined up. I mean, if you wanna drill things or zip tie things, which I don't recommend, then you can do it, but I'm only doing it because I wanna get you guys day one coverage. So stay tuned for that. And if you have any questions, guys, be sure to drop a comment in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit that like button. And of course, if you dislike this video, then don't forget to slam that dislike button and I'll catch you guys in another tech video very soon. Peace out for now, bye.